No. Uh, 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 was beautiful. Yeah. There were no Americans there. Yeah. That's yeah. <laughs> just Israelis. Where is it? I don't have a bad time. No Americans there. There you go. You have an Android watch? It doesn't help me. I don't even know why. All right, let's go. Running a little late here from the Meyer. I missed the Meyer of Two. So you're extra late. I'm extra late. I'm all over the place. You hear me? You, yep. You're going to help. Yep. Uh oh. Loud, loud and clear. Okay, so we're up to Simon Test, Siv Zion. Yeah. We have all the right volume this week. Yeah. Okay. More or less. Uh, okay, so let's try and make some. So let's let's try and cover some ground. So Kadesh Yisat the Patalus. Before you wear the talus, before you wrap yourself in the talus, you have to get the and make So you have to check the tzitzis to see if they're kosher. The Torah lived the gamas a chutin chain beside her neck. You also have to check the the strings. Where's our where's our local talus? It's on the beam. Thanks. Um, you also have to check the strings that are inside the hole that's on the garment. That's a krichas and also what's wrapped. Thank you. Right. Well, last nice. week was much more yellow than this one. <laughs> Anyways, so you're supposed to check these strings, but that's what everybody checks. But really, most of the time, these strings are going to be kosher. You got to you say you check here. Also, you have to check in here, right? The chutin besoich nekev and also the krichas to make sure it's not not cut. Right. Nice. The knots, yeah. What the previous means wrapped up. The gam yafrid is a chutin. You also supposed to separate the chutin, right? So all those guys that walk around for a half hour before dominating, you know, with the top of the So is this before you make the bracha? Yes, yes, before yes. you make the bracha. So I'm yeah, just saying, it doesn't say that. No, it, it will say that, no? Briscoe. Okay, fine. Okay. Okay. Oh, no, he doesn't. No, you're How right. How can you make the bracha and then find it's going to be possible? I right, just no, want to make, I'm not saying, the, no, I'm just, I want to make sure we're all clear. Yeah, Kaidem Shei Yisatev Patalus. Kaidem Shei Yisatev no, Kaidem Shei Yisatev Patalus means before you, before you, and you got to make a bracha before, which we'll get to in a minute. Begam Yafer is a chutin, right, so you got to separate the chutin. Shaloyu Mutokin Zebazeh. So this is not so, I mean, most people's talus strings are not, you know, intertwined, but the talus cotton, I think, needs a lot more help with that. No, it depends if you wash it. What are yeah. some of the strings shorter than others? That's fine. That's okay. fine. We said last week it should be. Okay. You should have them around the same size. Right? Shall I even talk about Zebazev? Even the Shtana love the basic ones, but let's say you're going to come late to Shul, which I don't think is going to get anybody around here. No, of course. Right? Shabbat Shalom. 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 Shabbat then ain't it sorrowful about going to allow freedom, so you don't have to check them and separate them. Why? Because you have a chazaka already? Yeah, yeah. Prime. You really, really, why are you checking it every day? Right? You don't check your tefillin every day. Because it's easy. It's easy to check. That's so tefillah b'tzibur is more important than checking the talus. Yes, yes. Tefillah b'tzibur okay. is more important than, yes, 100%. Um, also, you could do another thing is you could check them before you take them off. And then one, when you take them off, the you day. check them and then put them right in the bag. Uh, There's no chance that it's going to. The previous day, you mean? Right, when you're on, on your way out of shoot, but nobody wants to check them because everybody's in a rush. So, so they'd rather check. You know, if you plan on late being late the next day, <laughs> right? Rather be late to davening than have to stay till the end. Um, yeah, but when you wash the tzitzis, that it does bring when you're on the on the bottom is when you wash the tzitzis. So that that makes it all all uh, messed up. So then you have to check. Yeah. Fine. So that's Siv Zayin. Fairly simple. Ches is called mitzvahs varchal and over lasiyosan. All the mitzvahs you make a bracha on them. Over lasiyosan, which means pirush koyde masiyah. Right. One of the more interesting things because over means to pass over. So we're saying you pa- you you're supposed to make a mitzvah, you make a bracha when you pass over the asiya, meaning it means koyde, meaning before. You're supposed to always make a bracha before you do the mitzvah. Laachar bracha, take it from the yad. Tzarech lasis is a mitzvah below hefzik. And when you make the bracha, then you immediately have to do the mitzvah without a hefzik. Well, most people put okay. on the tals first. No, you got to make right, the bracha we'll first and then put on the tals. Yeah, okay. we're going to learn now exactly how to do it. Okay. Because there's unfortunately a, a major part of us do not put on a talis properly. 
So let's see. Lachain, this is what you got to do. Arches is a talus, You have to hold the talus in both of your hands. Right? It was one hand is not already. Could be in one two second. hands folded. No, no, let's see. We'll go. We'll get to it. We'll get, yeah, yeah, I'll do it. Look, I just don't want to stand up because I'm lazy. is a talus, If you hold the talus with two hands, be a chavin and have kavana, shetzivanu ha kodesh baruchu. You're supposed to have in your kavana. And Hashem commanded us to wrap ourselves in tzitzis to remember all the mitzvahs. See the tzitzis and remember all the mitzvahs. Right? So you saw that's the point. Right? And then you have to make the bracha standing. You don't put on a talus when you're sitting down unless you're not well. Yeah? The bracha is patsitzis. Now, there's a controversy. Is it bat sitzes or bit sitzes? Anybody have any idea what they say? Because I have no idea what I said. You say ba? Yeah. Ba. You say ba? I think so. I, what do I say? I can I say ba. Yeah. Tomorrow. Because that's the way he says it. The Mishnah Bruder. The Mishnah Bruder say says. What? I say bit sitzes. You say the bit sitzes? The Mishnah Bruder says to say bit sitzes. Right? Oh, now we know. Um, okay, whichever Arch, way you do Arch it. Scroll says ba. Art scroll says ba. Yeah. Okay. What do I say? I actually said What does the girl say? Be. 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 What if you just say talus? I said it's good. What does that say? Who is talus? He has a gross. There's, there's no mitzvah to put on talus. The mitzvah is to put on tzitzis. The tzitzis goes on the talus. Right? Shame on the gross. Okay, we'll, we'll demonstrate this in a second. And you wrap it immediately, your head, until under your mouth, okay? Which is also a controversy. So meaning, meaning, um, here we go. It's all like this, right? So you're taking the talus. So when he means both hands, you got to put it like this, right? So you're making both hands. It can be in front of you. What? Can be in front of you, two hands. The closest to doing it. It's more of a half stick. It's, it's on like you. this. I don't know. Like he said, he's holding in two hands. Is it here, hands. you should make the bracha with the least amount of half stick between, between the bracha and, and putting on. Go like this? No, it shouldn't be on your head because once it's it on your head, it's already yeah. part of doing the mitzvah. I'll say that. Right? Again, look at what he says. That's the atifa. It says, Viatif is Rosh Adlamazami Piv. Meaning, first make the bracha, then you have to wrap your head until where? Your, until the, until the bottom upper, of your mouth. Why the bottom? The bottom of your mouth. Why the why bottom? bottom? One second. But he brings Cholkam on the bottom. Um, you should not, uh, you should only go to your eyes. He brings one Shita. Adlamazami right? Piv. Or... What are you saying? Oh, there's a banging over the head, so that's uh, well, so that's the thing. So that's what, right. So, etof means to wrap. Now, they could see you right? can still see, you have to be able to see. No, but here's the thing because when you wrap it, there's like a little opening. Why do you have to be able to see? What do you say? Where does it say you have to be able to see? When you wrap it over your head, I don't know where he said you have to be able to see. We've got a commentator over there saying you got to see. Who says that? What do you got to see? What do you say you got to see? Where does he say that? I didn't hear what he said. I don't know what he said. What do you say about seeing? What? I didn't say seeing. I don't know. Okay, anyways, the lowest you can go is the mouth. Some say just to the eyes. That part. What? If this once you wrap it over your head, you'll be able to see out. You're able to see out. You have to be able to see out. I don't know if you have. Eh. It's not covering. He's saying dependent on. Well, okay, if you go and wrap it around, so they, should they have to be able to see. I mean, my arms are getting tired. But then... <laughs> hey, do you want me? Do you want me to stand up and do it? No, it's, yeah. it's fine. You go. Meaning, if you go over to your shoulders, that's too much. Right, you go past your mouth. Past your mouth is too much. Too much. Just up to your mouth because that's not the proper way to wear it. See, the thing is, you have to do itof. Itof is called wrapping. You have to wrap it like Yishmael. That's what he says in the next time. What you do is you take the corners and you put it onto your neck. Right? You put the corners up to your neck. Right? And then, 
and then we yamar apsukim my yoga. Then you have he to stay like that. Why? Why? Okay. Why do you have to wear a towel? It's like Arabs wear their clothes. What? What oh. is that? What is that? What do you mean? Is it, is it I agree. Why, why are they? Why is that not the definition of rabbi? Like because Yishmol did tshuva before he died. They're just defining oh, the wrapping. No? What's the problem? It's just defining the wrapping. No, why? no, it's not defining it. Saying that we do it the same way the Arabs wear their shirts to it's go a, kill Jews. The muscle, we have no? to wear our towels that way. <laughs> Does that make sense to you? Wear your towels the same I way didn't see those words like that. The same way they can stop it with their overcoats, you should wear your towels. Does that make any sense? <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah, no, but the reason is because Atifa, why is the bracha list? You have to answer this. Why I don't know. I didn't make the bracha because I didn't make, you know, I don't like the list of Yosin, so I did, for sure didn't make the brachas of Tiago. I didn't make the bracha. Okay, anyways, you have to understand what does it mean, list but it's. Why is it saying list So you have to do ituf. So ituf is this grabbing, you gotta grab the four corners. See, I went too low already. See, I'm, I'm too low, right? <laughs> I'm too low. You gotta go only to the mouth, four corners, and then like this. I don't think I have the four corners. And then sure like- you hit somebody behind you also. You gotta stay like this before, I don't know, how, many, how long does it take? Tends to slow you off. Tends to slow you off. No, but unfortunately, if you look around Shul tomorrow morning, you will see that a majority of people have no idea what they think. Exactly. You say those three, three, what? Three, some put on it also doesn't say anybody you got to smack the guy next to you. Right? I'm not so sure I should look because then I'm going to know that shoulder. they don't know what they're doing. Yeah, well, the that's true. That's true. <laughs> It'll be like duchening, so you can't judge anyone's form. But then you can put out you can put out an ad, maybe you can put out an ad no, make everybody nuts. Shmuel Dovin only look at somebody if there's somebody read it. Somebody read you a shit that one of his children. Yes. So why are you wearing it? Because you're supposed to wear the towel. No, he, the point is, is the Iker Levisha is the Ituf. That's what comes out. Why is the davening all Ituf? Why don't we just leave it on like that yeah. the whole davening? I don't know. That's really the question. The question is not why. The question is why we don't do it. Then you can't so breathe. No, you can. You put. You just. You let your head. You let your head out of there. No, wait, you did it. You, you wait. You did it. You can't breathe. <laughs> I don't know. That's. Uh, then we make the bracha when the towel is cut. The whole. When the towel is cut. We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Right. Um, so you can ask questions on the towels. <laughs> Yeah, so now why do we taka make the talus not like that when you put it on the shoulders and we just leave it on our shoulders? So really, because you want to have two tzitzis in front of you and two behind you. You want to be surrounded, right? You're Which theoretically you the could do with the ito. You could do that with the ito. You're supposed no? to have the talus on your head the whole davin for yes. two covers. Right, and so what does that have to do with... No, so it's always over your head. I'm saying you can leave it on like the yishmaelim, the whole davening, and you'll have that too. It's not wrapped. Where are you going to take it the off? Top you don't need to wear the towels on your head. It's not wrapped over your head. <laughs> what do you mean? Okay, but that sure. bottom line is the Iker Mitzvah, the Levisha, is the Atifa, I'm sorry. That's the Iker Mitzvah, which is why you have to do that. And by the way, um, um, you're not allowed to talk. Well, we're going to get, uh, we'll get to it. Um, may, I don't know if we'll get to it tonight. There's no talking or no answering Omen either for those of us that come on time. <laughs> Right, or putting on our talis by Yishtabach or whatever. I'm sorry, <laughs> by, by the Kaddish after Rabbi Shmuel. Okay, let, let's do that. Right, so you, once you make the bracha on the talis, until it's wrapped around your head for those few seconds, shoulders, then, then, uh, then it's, uh, you can't make, you can't answer Amen. And if you do, then you have to make the bracha again. Right. Also, another problem that we didn't point out is that if you, if you do it too far to the front, then it's not going to be on your back. Right? That's no good either, right? If you take, a lot of people take those that do it correctly, but then they take the entire talus and put it around their head, right? Scrunch up in their hands. Like a scarf. They take it like a scarf. Yeah, That's no also good. no good because no it's not on your back. Don't Svartim do that? Don't Svartim do that? Don't they? No. Don't. Don't. The blue towels. Blue Listen, we already discussed that the blue towels makes more sense than the black towels. What do you want? He, he doesn't yeah. drink. Uh, oh no, so. no! Yeah. Why do you make any bracha again? If you already, if you already uh, finished wrapping. No, if you if you're mafsik. If you're mafsik, so what? 
because you're mafsik between the any time. When you when you if you make hamotzi or make a shahakal and then you talk. Yeah, but if you, you start eat, eating hamotzi, right? Right. I'm in what? the middle of, of if I'm in the middle of wrapping, right? And then I just I I I was mafsik and then I finished the wrapping. Then I would make it's as if I didn't do anything. So I put it over, let's say I put the towel. What do you mean? If you talk before you ate it, because I'm, I'm about to swing it over my, my left shoulder, and then I say I'm in before I do that, and then I swing it over my shoulder. You right. say make That's a bra again and do it again? Yeah, you have to make the bra. Even again. though I completed the act. Even though you did you only did the first part. You didn't do the hear what he's asking. Before he's asking not well, let's say you put the thing, you put the towel over the head, you made the bra, then you put the towel over till here, and then you grab the four corners. And then you answer on main. To what? To a to Kaddish. Yesh Mirava, Baruch, or whatever. You make a new bracha now or not? Come on time. <laughs> come on time, correct. But let's say you did it. Or you say come on time for a very long time. Let's say you come on time and this know. happens. Right. Well, when's the Atifa over? I think, as far as I know, the Atifa is not over until you so wrap it around like that. So wrap it so even though I finished the Atifa, then oh, even though I was mafsik in between, I would have to start over. Right. Yes. Isn't that so that's what I understand? You make you make you I'm, take. Make I'm a asking, like I finished, I finished, I finished everything. I finished the entire act, right? But you didn't. I but know. I did. So what you did, you and put then it you mouth, to... right? It's, 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 yeah. Uh, you put it over here, and then as you're right before you're about to swing over your shoulder, you add to main, and then you finish that's, you swing but over you didn't your shoulder. Finish. That's not. But you not did coming. ultimately. You were mouth in between, but you still, you were still, you still so completed you the down act. After you washed. So it does. It's irrelevant. So yeah, it's not part of the mitzvah. It is what the wrapping yeah. part no, is. I'm saying answering the mitzvah is something that's not part of your mitzvah. No, it's but you don't know. People don't want to miss. You know, but people don't want to miss. Uh, I'm in. Right. Yeah. Anyway, so that's the way. That's the proper way to put on the talis. You don't have uh, to wait. Uh, wait until he's finished, and then they yeah. say, "I'm in." And put it down. Does that forbid to hold yourself when you look it over? What do you mean, or hold itself? It's like you're holding it up there. Does it have to really look like? Stay, rest stay on its by own. itself without your hands. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. You, you, you guys do it differently. You hold the whole thing. We take one side, then the other side. It doesn't take one side. Really right. I don't know. You do it all wrong. <laughs> right? You got to take all four He's corners. Closer to the Israeli. Israeli. You got to take. He's closer to the Israeli. You got to take all four corners and put it over there. All right. Now there are shitas, there are shitas that say that you're supposed to do this for Bahram. You're supposed to do this with your talus kata also. I I I've heard of people doing it, but most people don't do it. It's too small, you know. How would you get how would you wrap it? You say you talk to the city cash in a line. You don't say that? I don't say any extra. I say the <laughs> you should throw up your talus. You should do a tifa also. Do a type tifa with your talus cut and with your talus cut. The yeah. problem is it doesn't really go to at the beginning. Yeah, how would that work? You do that when you're putting it on. Oh, so you don't make house? you don't make a brach on the talus cut. Yeah. That's I mean, when you're married. You know, you said you married. Most people don't make a brach on the talus cut once you're married. Right. But see, Yaakov, I had heard what you don't, you know, it's not a real atifa. You're just supposed to, when you're putting it over your head, you're supposed to make the bracha. Meaning, before it lands on your shoulders, you're supposed to make the bracha. Meaning, while you're putting it over your head, you make the bracha. So when it comes onto your shoulders, you already made the bracha. Yes, that's true. Yes. But it's not, I don't think it's an atifa. You're just supposed no, it's to not, put it no, on. No, no, some bracha. say you turn the talus cut and side oh, really? and let it sit on your shoulder. No, and you, then, you don't make yeah. it almost, almost and put it over your head and swing, swing it around that way. The same thing that you do with a talus. You talus don't, goddle. You don't make it almost, 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 almost. What? See, what? See, what? See, you, see, lengthwise, you put it... That's the way I understand that's how they do it. Right? Um, but then he says, not like you, after you do this whole thing, then you could take the talus off your head. It's mashmi. You don't have to cover your head. You don't have to cover your head with the. You don't have to use a talus while you dive. That's what it's mashma. No, I mean, it's just some talent. Why would you? Because it says yochal asir Russia. Yeah. So it's a tif for the mitzvah. That's it. No, but if now you're davening, right? Yeah. So you should have. To, if you hold it, you have to keep the talus on your head. So what is he saying that you're able to take it off? You have to keep it on for davening. Oh, you mean like just? What? No, that's yeah. just. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's that's maybe that's, that's all. It's not talus. No, and the chanam is not all sitzes, but but he's saying. He would. He wouldn't say to take it off. But anyways, he brings on the footnote here of the Arizal and all that. You have to. 
that you have to keep the talus cover, the talus on when you're uh, um, when you're davening. You're supposed to keep it. You're supposed to keep it over your head. Okay. V'nochel lizar shaloy liberas achitzis ala aretz v'shem bizui mitzvah. It's proper to be careful not to not to drag your tzitzis on the floor, which is another interesting thing. He doesn't say it's usher. You got these people running around shul telling everybody, you know, your tzitzis on the floor, your tzitzis on the floor, getting making everybody crazy. It's only the lotion of the kitzer is that it's nachoy. It's proper to be careful that the tzitzis don't go on the floor, right? Because there is no kedusha to tzitzis. There's no, there's no. Um, there's, Meikar adin tzitzis do not need shamans. We say better to put it in shamans. Meikar adin doesn't have to. Okay, and then he says, you pick them up, and then what you could do is you could stick them into your belt. Which some people say not to do that. Not to stick the towels into your belt. Why? Some people say to stick your towels into your belt. Why are you making a scholarship? Towels into something that's good. There's under the chair. Same thing, belt, belt. Right? Correct, but the Torah has Kedusha. The Tzitzis is a mitzvah. There's, 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 there's a Kedusha of mitzvah and there's Kedusha of Kedusha, right? Something of Kedusha, like Tfilin, Tfilin, Mezuzah, Sefer Torah is much more. That's that's a kaddish. Tell me, you, you cannot throw out. Depends which one. Bag, the inner yeah, bag. Oh, yeah, the yeah. inner bag. But that's well, Tashmishe Kedusha. But the real, the truth is, you really could because, because you, have you have a box. Boxes. But since the knot of the tefillin doesn't go in the box, mm. then that's then the bag is considered like a direct Tashmish of the Kedusha. So that's why the tefillin bag you can't throw out. But if you have those. Uh, those army filling, yeah, you know, right, and then right. you put that into a bag, then yeah. that would be what the or the, or the, the can, you know, whatever it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we're not going down there, Rabarn, so we don't. You don't have to go up against that, <laughs> right? The, the canteen, uh, the canteen filling box. Yeah, I have nothing against it. The color to the towel. No, we're not talking about not for the towel. We're talking about for the regular. <laughs> I mean, for the one for the wannabes, the wannabes. The wannabes yes, yes. The, wannabes. the ones that want to eat a lot of breakfast but don't want to be in shape for the tzahal, so they just have to do it. Yeah. Um, does does sisters and tzahals have the same kedusha? Sisters and tzahals the same kedusha. You, yeah. So can you go yeah. to the bath into the bathroom with uh, the talus on then? Meikar, that's a good question. Meikar adin, you can go to the bathroom with a talus on. Yes. Yes. Um, I think the belt doesn't do it. It's just busy. You're going to get a lot of stairs. The, the reason I think the belt doesn't do it is because... Wait, wait, wait. What about... Well, it's, it's Katan. You can't go there. You, 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 you no, do go with a towel to the belt. I, I no, the reason... Say, 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 I think no, the reason why... The reason why I send you with a kittle. Can you go to the bathroom with a kittle? Yeah. Make it than you could, but I think most people don't. The reason that they don't is because it's considered a beggar that's meyuchud for davening. Right? So it's a bag that's with yochid for davening, so then that you really don't want to be in the bed. So that comes out. That so people take off their gartels also? So some, yeah, yeah. So we the, use them, them, we, we use some them on Pesach. Some people want to their hats. Right, we use them on right? Pesach. Not use for... them on Pesach, so that, that's a, yeah, you use them on Pesach. So maybe not. You guys have put on the mask only for davening. <laughs> I was going to say something else. You see, see the Shagai, some of the heavy beautiful see them. Don't bring their hat into the bathroom either. Right yeah. now, us guys, or those of us that wear hats for davening, we shouldn't bring the hats into the bathroom because for us it's a beggar for people. But see them, yeah, they sleep right. with the hat. So why should they? Have, why should they have to take it off? Right? It's not for Right? Well, as far as I know, that the the, 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 the gato is often good for hanging. <laughs> so are you really talking to Lachal So if those of us that wear hats during davening should really not wear it into the bathroom? Something. When when I'm in the right mood, I won't bring my hat into the bathroom. Even though officially I wear my hat other times other than davening, but I try not to. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> yes, I, I don't want to quote it, but now that you quote it, you saw it, right? Not the show, not the show, right? Just the show, yeah. Just the show, yeah. He put his hat, he covered his hat with the film. What do you say? Well, that's what the, you know, the Hasidish people with the gartel. What about not going in the bathroom with a gartel? 
No, because they hold it to beg it that's so they don't want to bring it into the bath. Right? And the beggar does not? Or a hat or a suit jacket's not? A suit jacket, if you only use it for davening, then maybe if you go with that, then yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Now, so now, what do you do with the talus? This is an interesting thing. Is also siddish versus litvish. The litvish keep the talus over the shoulders, right? Because they want the two tzitzis in the front, two in the back, right? But a lot of revas, if you notice, will not. They don't do that. They keep the talus wrapped around their body the whole time, right? So you'll still have two. Uh, no, you have four in the front. You have four in the front. If you wrap the bottom, if you wrap the bottom. I don't know. I don't know. I never paid that much attention. I like being wrapped by the Okay, so the Yes, that's right. It shouldn't be on the floor. So you have to make sure they're all gathered anyway. Uh, if you hold that, it's yeah, okay. But uh, it's again, it's not the worst thing in the world to keep it on the, on the floor. Um, okay, so the yeshu yeshu. Some dafka want you to keep it on the shoulders, and some and some don't. Uh, yeah. What are the talus? Yeah, who's putting on a talus that's not the shear? Those don't work. Those don't work at all. Right? Those don't, yeah. Um, where is fine. Okay, it's fine. Okay, it's Okay, I guess we'll stop here. Uh, next week is up in the air. I'll be back in a few. A few. Wait, so that means. I didn't want to show off during the year, but I try not to wear my hat to the bathroom. Baron, and we appreciate you not taking video in the bathroom. <laughs> yeah. How about you, Yamaka? Do you keep that away? <laughs> I thought I was talking to adult people. I'm sorry. Oh, I apologize. Oh, oh he's going to pull the maturity card now. Okay, I see what's going on here. Okay. <laughs> How many guys are over there by his year? I don't know. I have no idea. Um, before you... COVID, uh, the one in Bayswater, probably uh, 15 to 20 guys, but I don't know about since COVID. One second. Did he just leave Bayswater now? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, Aaron, go take a shower. You want to take a shower? <laughs> what are you trying to say? Uh, I'm not trying to say anything. Over there. What? They changed it. It used to be 8.15. It's 8.40 now. Oh, I didn't copy He that. started because of davening, so he started he starts some later. So if you came every night, if you came every light night like me, then you would know these things, Kaplan. <laughs> Land, no, that's great. That doesn't, even, that doesn't even warrant the rebuttal. I'm just going to leave it at that one, okay? Rebar, back me up here. <laughs> who, who said I'm anything? here more than you, thank you very much. Really? Yeah, really. I, 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 I beg to differ on that one, then, Aftali, buddy. I love you a lot, but I don't think that's the case. Uh, Aaron, Yehuda Kaplan is your father? That is the case, yes. Jeff, send him my regards. Most definitely. He said the second bris is for free, by the way. <laughs> oh, the hustle's here. It's actually <laughs> half off. <laughs> no, uh, good joke. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> hey, Byron, those are, that's a new hey, don't leave. Tonight. Don't leave. <laughs> <laughs> I got more no. where that came from. Yo, so you didn't go to the dinner? I did. Well, what he was he playing videos from ten years ago? What's he doing? I, I don't know. I don't understand the shot of it, but whatever. What a clown! Need something to put on a video, huh? It didn't look so packed. No, it wasn't. It was more of a in and out type of thing. That's what it was. I was there for literally five minutes. Yeah. Who's dinner? What shot in the tent? What's the shot in the tent? COVID. 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 He, he's COVID friendly. 
Yeah, in his yeah. show, he has it re inside. But the of, of all the places, I'm pretty outside. sure Groner is not worried about COVID. It's a joke. It's a joke. Jesse, it was a joke. Take it easy. Sit this mm. one out, Jesse. By the way, uh, are you around all summer or do you go away at all? Talking to me? Yeah. I'm around. Why? Uh, no, I'm just curious the about the minion. Leaving, uh, it's part of his contract, he has to stay. Right. Uh, uh, yes, I, I negotiated a few weeks off in the summer. Oh, you did? Okay. Me and Rabbi Feiner. Oh, I have him cover for me when I'm away. You get six maybe, weeks off. One second. Maybe, Rabbi, maybe you can fill in a Scotland residence the week that I'm out. No problem. Where are you going? Where are you going? I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Aaron, Aaron, the Aaron, I, I don't know now we did, we, when we, we took regions so we took yeah. the Hebrew we, we took the Hebrew region everybody prepared you had to write an essay so everybody prepared let's say your one page essay you memorized it and whatever they asked you you got in your trip to Israel whatever if you, said, write what, you know, if you had to write about a dream say I dreamt that I went to Israel and on the trip I went blah, blah, blah. Whatever any any of the choices, you always fit in your, your trip to Israel. Okay. So I'm saying you. I doesn't matter which week you go away. I'll give the same drusha. Look at you, such a natural. <laughs> always prepared. You're saying. Yeah. I thought you. Could, I thought at first you're gonna play that Nevis card. You can make me ask you three times. No, we we have too close of a relationship to do that. 